hi, and welcome to Rural Art Connection, the place where your boredom ends and creativity begins. Today, we are going to try to do the Paint Like a Sim challenge. This challenge has been done by I Has Cupquake, Lauren Z Side, Sherda, Yami, BB Paws, Gaming, The Gaming Mermaid, Moon Dust Brie. All these other wonderful ladies before me have completed this challenge digitally and traditionally, but as an art teacher, I thought that I should try to take a swing at this and see if I hit it out of the park or if I only make it to the outfield. So please comment down below at the end if you think that I did a good job or if I sucked and let me know what I need to work on. So please enjoy. And don't hesitate to check out these ladies goes as well. And your butt out of the air. Lillian! Just like look at this chick with her butt in the air. Do you see that? Look at her. <laughs> so we got a flower, a horse, and a llama thingy. So this is what we started off with. To try to make this as realistic and official as possible, I found these little mini canvases at the 99 cent store, and remarkably enough, they were 99 cents. So this is quite the deal for the canvas plus the little wood uh, easel. And the easel actually stands up, and it has a bending mechanism, and so you can actually set up like a real tiny easel. So here we go, now we're gonna start painting our first little painting and I love recycled palettes any kind of plastic any kind of thing that you can use to recycle by all means have at it I'm just gonna tell you right now that this is not an attractive angle for me <laughs> um yeah so enjoy this angle because the next couple paintings are not gonna be at this angle this Beautiful, beautiful, up close to my double chin area. <laughs>
This one came out really, really good, but then... So this is the fun glow-in-the-dark glitter glue that I used to create the glow-in-the-dark aspect of these paintings. I got it at the 99 cent, 99 cent store for $1.99. And if you use multiple layers, you can get a really nice glowing effect. But I had to come in and use multiple layers. Uh, one thin coat doesn't quite do it. But after two coats, then usually it's thick enough and dark enough to hold the color. So with my pony, I didn't quite get enough layers down. So as you can see, you can see it glowing with the help of the glue bottles, but it won't really do it on its own besides the eye. Comment down below if you like this glow-in-the-dark aspect that I changed up for these paintings, or if you like the original just classic painting. Also mine versus the sims which ones do you like better please comment down below and let me know that you like this video like share and subscribe all good things and we'll catch you in the next one yeah. okay. bye 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 see ya see ya